Okay, I didn't expect I'd end up fighting my own clone. Its power and other characteristics appear to be the same as mine. And I suppose its body and abilities are the same as mine as well. It's not every day an opponent shows up where you know all of their strengths and weaknesses. Nobody knows me better than me, after all. I can use that to my advantage. I'll pull out all the stops, since I'm basically fighting myself. The battle's about to start! Good luck! Of this like a duck to water. Try this one next. Yes. Yeah. Over here. Yeah. Good job. You've come this far, so I'm sure you'll be fine. Maximum power. That's all you've got. yourself for the coming battle! Yeah! 
Take it! 
No escape! Hell's on grenade! Take it! Get back here! Hell's on grenade! We're running some tests on 18 over at the Capsule Corporation. There's nothing wrong with her physically, so she should come around soon. It's gonna be okay. Relax, Krillin. You look like it's the end of the world. <laughs> well, it kinda is. But I take your word over doom and gloom any day. Thanks, Bulma. <laughs> Hey, Krillin, my new roommate here also says to not worry about it. Well, we'll see this thing through, no problem. You can count on it. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Thanks. <laughs> you know, you're pretty cool. I mean, for a soul without a body, I guess. You know, I think you and me are going to be good friends. <laughs> the thing that's puzzling me right now is Android 16's role in this whole dilemma. The 16 I know wouldn't go along with the Red Ribbon Army's twisted way of doing things. It's true. 16 was never one of the bad guys. When Android 16 first showed up on the scene, he did talk about another 16. I wonder if the 16 I saw was a copy built with the original specs. Maybe. But I don't know. He didn't seem like a completely different Android. You have a point. Okay, okay. What if he is a copy, but with the original's memory? Who knows, Bulma? Either way, our only course of action at this point is to find the army's base. Huh. Guess you're right. Over there! Guys, look! It's Gohan! <sighs> That's a relief. It looks like he just lost consciousness. What'd you expect? He's made from tougher stuff than you. Give me a break, Piccolo. You know these Saiyans are too robust for their own good? Another clone, huh? Well, they're a stubborn bunch. Goku, I'll keep this guy company. Get Gohan somewhere safe. Huh? Knowing Goku, I bet he used instant transmission to get Gohan out of here. Alright, now that Gohan's all safe with Bulma, I can finally focus on some fighting! Hey, Piccolo! Your face has turned red. Why are you embarrassed? 
I'm not. Okay. Hey, man, whatever you say. <laughs> Look, never mind that. We need to come up with a way to take care of this guy. A fierce showdown is about to begin! Let's go, Chris! Let's go, Chris! 